Hi guys and welcome back to another Tuesday 2 minute tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can create this really cool underwater effect in your photos using Photoshop. And I'm going to start right now. Right guys, so the first thing you want to do is just go ahead and choose a photo and then go ahead and download the photo from the link in the description of this water effect you can see here. Once you've done that, we can go ahead and place it onto a photo of your choice. And if you'd like to follow along, I'm going to be using this photo as the base photo for this particular tutorial. So what we want to do is to get that photo and then we're going to place the water photo over the top and then change the blending mode and add a few more additional effects. So once you've got the background photo open, we're gonna go ahead and drag that water photo over the top. And what we're gonna do is make it to its maximum size. So we're gonna go ahead and drag it open. Now you can drag it open and drag it over until you are happy of the placement. And I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger and I'm gonna place all of these bubbles just to the right hand side. So we're gonna go that and then click enter on your keyboard to confirm the placement. Once we've done that, we want to change the blending mode of this particular layer to color. So we'll go to our blending mode options and we're gonna go down to color like so and we'll choose it, lovely. What we want to do now is actually duplicate that layer. So we've got that layer here, we're gonna press command J on our keyboard or you can right click and click duplicate layer and then we're gonna actually rename this and we're gonna choose the blending mode of hard light. So we're gonna choose a blending mode of hard light like so. And as you can see, this effect is starting to take shape, but there's just one more effect I want to add. So at the moment, we're losing a lot of the kind of skin tones of the girl. We want to bring some of them back. So what we can do is actually have our background here. We're gonna duplicate that background layer by pressing Command J. Then we're gonna drag that to the front like so, and we're gonna create a layer mask. So we're gonna go down and click on our layer mask icon like so. Once you've got a layer mask of complete white, we're gonna go up to image in the top left hand corner, and then we're gonna go down to apply image. And what that'll do is it will apply that image to the layer mask, and we want to choose layer mask of merged with a blending style of multiply. And then we're gonna go ahead and click okay. And then once you've done that, what we want to do is reduce that down to around 75%. And there we go guys. So if we do the before, and we do the after, we've created this really cool underwater effect. And there we go, guys.